Hey guys, uh, Wildock Studios here, and today we're going to talk about Unreal Engine 5.5's release and some caveats that have been catching people. Um, one of the biggest impacts to people's workflow and projects is the fact that as of right now, as far as I can tell, Lumen no longer works in SM5 with DirectX 11. And why that matters is because if you do a performance profile between the uh, DX11 and DX12 um, and the SM5 and SM6 shader model, DX5 has no problem hitting frames. I mean, I average around 120 frames. That's my maximum monitor refresh rate, but it, it even climbs higher than that. Um, and I've been able to successfully push projects to like say the Steam Deck or lower end hardware that can run Lumen in um, software ray tracing mode uh, pretty well actually um, actually my my day job consists of an application that uses DirectX 11, S, uh, 11 and, and SM5 for Lumen generation due to lack of hardware uh, ray tracing capable uh, pixel streamed machines um, in Unreal Engine 5 I mean and I can bring up a, a project and show you but um, I do have, uh, this may end up being a bug. I did dig into the code, the USH shader code, and I can see where they're working on the deferred rendering pipeline and trying to unify that across like the mobile deferred rendering. Um, and there's a lot of flags being tossed around in there. Um, there's also uh, a few spots in code that handle some of the rendering capabilities between SM5 and SM6. So it, it's pretty hairy. But I did notice in the release notes, they make it seem like SM5 Lumen support should still be available. Um, I don't see where it's officially been mentioned to be deprecated. Um, but, you know, asking ChatGPT is like, oh yeah, they deprecated this, um, but I haven't seen anything official. I've also been on Source Discord and asking around, and I haven't received any official air, uh, any messages. So this could be a bug that might get hot fixed. I don't know. Let's hope so, um, because you you do see a substantial performance difference. Um, let me see. Uh, I actually have a post, a forum post up um, about this, and I'll bring this up here. Um, I went through and I profiled the difference here. And as you can see, uh, this is an Unreal Engine 5.4 uh, project and DX11 with shader model uh, SM5 and Cascade Shadow Maps because virtual shadow maps don't work unless you're in SM6. And um, you can see that the uh, frame rate I'm getting is a solid 120 frames. Um, really low game time here and really low draw. Um, and this works great. I didn't have to, like, no other settings were changed. Um, and this is at native resolution, right? Um, so if we look at uh, changing the engine version, which that's all I did, um, it, you'll see Lumen is no longer working in 5.5 um, with DirectX 11 as the uh, RHI. Um, and I also tried DX12 with shader model sm5 to see because you can like cut back on the cost of your shaders maybe still get lumen gi but of course it didn't work until i enabled sm6 and then here's a profile of that um it's it's essentially a 20 frame loss but if i uncap my frames it's actually more than that um i'm i'm averaging around 140 135 or so this is a, a rtx 20 ti by the way um, but when you start looking at lower end hardware, it's even more substantial because your, your gains um, on the amount of memory that you're moving around, et cetera, et cetera, um, it's, it's just a really substantial hit moving to SM6 and um, everything that comes with that for DX12. Um, so yeah, uh, I've outlined it here. I'll include this link in um, the video in the description um, I was just, you know, wanting to get on top of this and letting everyone know who may have projects that are like thinking about migrating, make a backup, um, 
you know, if you're not using source control, use source control. And maybe if you're thinking or you're on the fence of migrating, just keep this in mind that if you are falling back to the older DX11 rendering pipeline for performance reasons, you're gonna lose Lumen GI, at least at this current state. Um, wanna say thanks to all the Patreon members. Um, remember to hit that like and subscribe button and uh, keep the video suggestions coming. Um, until next time, guys, toodles.